Last night I had a dream about a room prepared and ready for a baby to be born. The room was decorated with small square gingham, which turned into confetti for a New Year's celebration with friends where a beautiful beef dinner paired with wine was served. A baby being born reminds me of John 3, 5, when Jesus said, I tell you the truth, no one can enter the kingdom of heaven, the kingdom of God, unless he is born of water and the spirit. The room prepared reminded me of John 14, 1 through 4, when Jesus said, Let not your heart be troubled. You believe in God, believe also in me. In my Father's house are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you. I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you to myself, that where I am, there you may be also. And where I go, you know, and the way, you know, Jesus is the way, the truth, and the life. The New Year's celebration reminded me of Rosh Hashanah Yom Teruah, the Feast of Trumpets, the beginning of the Jewish New Year next month. The beautiful beef dish and wine reminded me of Isaiah 25, 6. The Lord Almighty will prepare a feast of rich food for all peoples, a banquet of aged wine, the best of meats and the finest of wines. At his right hand are pleasures forevermore, and we will be fully satisfied in his presence. The wine also reminded me of communion when we remember Jesus' sacrifice on the cross and the shedding of his blood for our sins. In Matthew 26, 29, before Jesus went to the cross, he told his disciples, I tell you, I will not drink of this fruit of the vine from now on until that day when I drink it anew with you in my Father's kingdom. Praise the Lord. I then had a dream about a man who had died, and people had his funeral. But then he was alive, and he could see not only all the kingdoms of the earth, but also how people responded to his death. He didn't seem to be happy about the nonchalant way some people responded. To assist people with their responses, to help them take every thought captive in the midst of a spiritual battle, To cover their minds from confusion, slander, fighting, poisonous input, lies, and all harm, there was a confirmation of our Heavenly Father's presence as we watch. And a man in my dream named Michael brought me a bundle of flutes and clarinets, which led me to this song. (laughs) 